hi guys welcome to my channel i'm da sylvia on hey guys welcome back to my channel i am da sylvia on a nigerian youtuber living in on nature if this is your first time tuning in thank you so much so please just go to the subscribe button and hit the subscribe button do not forget to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified anytime i post a new video to my returning subscribers thank you you guys are the best so guys i'm still feeling myself I'm feeling myself. I'm feeling myself. Hey, hey. <laughs> don't mind me, guys. So I did this look for a sit-down video. I'm still looking at myself. I'm sorry. I'm so I don't know. I feel like I look so cute. Anyway, guys, I'm still. I just finished a sit-down video, and I said a lot in that video. In fact, if you have not watched that video, I titled it. It's about getting married, not getting married in your early 20s. I, I don't know the title. I've not figured out the title that I would use. But it's about not getting married in your 20s. Just look for the video or maybe I should just link it up here for you to watch. And after that video, I was looking at my beautiful makeup because not me it's about the makeup i was looking at my beautiful makeup and i said i can't waste this look you know hey i can't waste this i don't even know if i'm going to wash my face today i decided to use this beautiful face and start a vlog so welcome to my vlog i'll see you guys later maybe tomorrow love you guys bye good morning guys how are you guys doing so I started this vlog yesterday and today I'm going to MTN office because I need new SIM card. Honestly, I don't know what is happening in Nigeria. They said that they have started giving out SIM cards again and who guys, you don't want to see the queue at MTN office. The other day I was passing there and it was too much so I decided to go to Mem Market to buy SIM card getting there they now told me that Elter sim card is five thousand naira mtn sim card is three thousand five hundred naira and glow sim card is three thousand naira i just told the person let me call my husband he's the one that sent me immediately i said hello they said the sim card is three thousand i caught the call i pick chris i tell them say my husband say make a no buy hey <laughs> buying sim card for three thousand naira in this economy adamant <laughs> i don't understand what is going on so this morning i decided to go and stay in that queue even if it's going to take me maybe 10 hours today i'm going to stay there i've packed everything i'll be editing the videos that i made yesterday because i want to drop the video maybe today or tomorrow i don't know when i'll be dropping the video but if you've not seen that video you better go back <laughs> especially if you are single i discussed a lot about getting married early which is something i don't support in that video that video should be up by now okay before you see this the video will be up but let me link it here so if you've not seen that video rush now to the video go and watch it then come back so guys i'm about to have breakfast i'm peeling avocado i'm having it with bread this morning you know avocado is good for the womb if you are a ttc mom just try i i never liked this growing up i don't eat this but now i see myself eating it because they said it's good for the womb i even had to research and i found out that it's true so as a ttc mom i do eat avocado now but this is something i hated with passion like Everybody in my house will be eating this and I will tell you people to take it away from me So guys I want to carry you guys along to MTN office and You know, I will still go to Mem Market because Whenever I cross that area, I'll go to Mem Market to buy a butter. That is my worst addiction <laughs> Major reason why I'm sitting here this morning to discuss with you is to say thank you for chi if baby guys six months ago i can remember diana calling not six months ago it should be nine months no eight months ago 
I can remember Diana calling people to come and show up for me to get me to 1,000 subscribers. And a lot of people came. I can still remember what happened that day. <laughs> you don't want to hear. My mom, at some point, was asking if I was running mad the day I got to 1,000. <laughs> hmm. Honestly, due to the fact that I was doing on Asia videos, my watch hour was at 3,800. I was just two months on YouTube and my watch hour was at 3,800. So it was just remaining 200 for me to hit 4,000 watch hours. But my subscriber count was, it should be 700 or so, but I know that it was above 500. It should be 700. So I was at the village. Do you know the funny thing? I got to 1,000 subscribers the very day I filmed my viral video. I know a lot of you will not understand. I traveled to the village to spend some time with my mom. Then I went down to see my auntie. And after spending some time with her, she was talking about seeing dead people. I felt like this one that mama is talking about seeing dead people. Is it possible that maybe very soon she's going to leave us? I thought, what do I do? How do I keep a memory of her? Let it not be like my dad that just left without giving anybody any notice. I said, okay. Let me film a makeup video and put it in my channel at least. So I went to her house the first day. We filmed a video. I went home. That day that I filmed my first makeup video, if you if you watch that video, you will see that the second one turned out better than the first one. I didn't have a foundation shade. I traveled with my makeup bag, my personal makeup bag. I used my foundation to film that first makeup video. Yeah. So I filmed the first one. I went to my saw that the eyeshadow was kind of dark. Everything was off. I said, no, I'm going to film a second one. And the second day we went to her house, filmed the second video, which was the one I later uploaded. On our way back, I was now seeing 800 subscribers. And that very day I was lamenting. I was telling my mom, maybe due to network issues, the number of subscribers I was gaining when I was in the village was reducing. I was not telling her maybe I need to go back to the city. I don't understand staying here and I'm not gaining subscribers the way I should. She was like telling me, no, now you came to stay with me. You don't have to go. I was feeling bad. But then, after everything, we were now leaving Mama's place. I saw my channel. It was just blowing up. 800 subscribers. I said, ah. I told my mom somebody hacked my account. My YouTuber has been hacked. My mom said, no, it's not possible. The Lord I'm serving will not allow it. I said, mom, maybe I've hacked it. How can I be complaining that I'm still on 700? Like, it's not going. That period, I was getting at least 10 subscribers a day. But that very day, that moment when I was in the village, I was getting maybe three, maybe two, maybe five. I told my mom, no, it's like this village. The network is affecting my YouTube. I need to go back to the city. So I was feeling bad that day. I just went, did my makeup video, left like nothing happened. And on our way, I was not seeing 800. I said, no. Before I knew it, 850. I called my mom. I said, no, somebody is hacking my account. This is not possible. Something is happening. My mom was like, no, it's not possible. How can somebody hack your account? How can it be possible? I said, mommy, you see, this village, had it been I was in on it, I will see what is happening. I rushed to Lily Pope's CV, her community post. I didn't see any post about me. I rushed to Dine Poem, no post. I told my mom, they did not share me, which means somebody is hacking it. How can I be getting 150 subscribers in within, within, within 10 minutes? How is it possible? I said, mom, no, no, no. You have killed me. This village has killed me. I need to go back. I was now shouting, then I saw upload Dine Kweme 25. I opened the video. I'm now seeing where she was talking about me. I said, hey! And she said, get her to 1,000. I said, Jesus, Jesus. I decided to rush home. The way I was rushing home with speed that day, my mom was like, ah, ah, what is it? I said, mommy, I'm hitting 1,000 today. She said, it's not possible. <laughs> so nobody is hacking you. I said, no. Diana said something about me on her channel and I'm hitting 1,000 today. So we rushed home. I was now checking. There was, in fact, we don't have network in my compound. So I would rush to my uncle's house. I would check. It's 900. 
next time i'll go back 950 i was checking when i went outside and i saw 1000 i ran inside like a mad woman oh my god i was shouting and dancing i danced like david danced in the bible that day i was just dancing my mom was like Chidim, are you still okay? Are you sure you are not going mad? I said, Mommy, it's better for me to go mad than to stay here. I danced, I screamed, I was shouting, I was pushing the girls to dance with me. <laughs> I was pushing the girls to dance with me. I was thanking God. I didn't know it was going to happen this way, but it did. And I was thanking God. And honestly, guys, it's just as if that very day, a miracle just decided to happen in my life because that was the day I filmed my viral video. Like I wasn't expecting it and all of a sudden I posted that video and everything was like film. <laughs> it just took my channel from here to here. And I thank God. I thank God and I thank you guys for coming in and for everything. I posted about Chi Ifebi and I went to her channel. I was in her comment section and a lot of people were saying that Sylvia sent me. It made me proud I was emotional that day I was asking myself is this how God blesses someone eight months ago or nine months ago someone said something about me in her channel and people were coming to see me and here we are nine months later I'm asking you guys to go help someone and you all went there i still can't believe that i've gotten to the point where i would say help me with this and a lot of people would actually do that for me is a blessing a blessing and it's touching because i know it's god that did that for me i know it's god that puts me in this position because I never imagined that I would be in this position at this point. And here I am, 2021, not even up to half of 2021. 32,000 subscribers later. I will be hitting one year in May 10th. And I'm grateful to God Almighty, to you guys for coming through for me. And I want to announce that on May 10th, 2021, that I will be turning one year on youtube i would be coming live and please if you are coming on that live bring your a game i want to show you guys my true self get ready because the real me is about to show the real me is about to pop up honestly so get ready on the may 10th i would love you guys to choose the time for the live session if you want it to be maybe um maybe 4 p.m 5 p.m or 6 p.m you guys are going to choose please tell me i'm still going to make a community post about it may 10th is the date that sylvia is turning one year on youtube one year later 32,000 subscribers later over 2.3 million views later like hey it's my testimony god has been so good to me so that day is going to be a beautiful one a, i don't know what i'm going to say because a lot of things are going to happen in that live session just bring on your a game it's not just about questions we will be popping wine popping champagne a lot of things will happen that day so get ready and guys please i just want to say thank you i love you guys so much and i value you okay so let's get ready um i just let me just finish this off camera love you guys so much please get ready for my life because <laughs> it's not going to be a small one just get ready get yourself ready i'll see you oh gosh let me finish eating i'll see you guys later